When printing to the HP L25500, L26500, or L28500, the heat settings play a crucial role in producing a quality print. While media profiles are made to work for all users, a profile made in a particular environment where there may be high humidity, like in Southeast Texas, may not work the same in a place like Las Vegas, Nevada, where there is very low humidity. If you're experiencing ink smudge issues, I would recommend a two-step process in Onyx. The first is to test slightly altered heat settings, and the second is to edit the actual media profile once the testing is complete. Depending on where the smudges appear will determine what you adjust. If you are experiencing ink smudging only at the start of a print, you should change the warm up drying temp offset and warm up curing temp offset. If necessary, the drying and curing temperatures may also be adjusted. First, make sure that your start print setting is set to manual. If it is not, press change and select group jobs together from the placement drop down menu. Then press OK. With a job in the rip queue, right click on the job and then select edit and choose printer settings. In the printer settings window, select advanced options. Here, you will want to decrease the warm up drying and curing temp offset. In this example, the warm up drying temp offset is set to 9 and the curing temp offset is set to 0. I will decrease the warm up drying temp offset in increments of 3, changing the setting to 6. Press OK and then save settings. At this point the job would be printed. If the ink smudging hasn't been eliminated, the process should be repeated and the warm up drying temp offset, and if applicable, the curing temp offset, should be reduced in increments of 3 until the problem is fixed. If the problem persists, you may need to adjust the drying and curing temperatures. If it has been fixed, the testing phase is complete and we will be ready to move on to step 2 where these changes can be made permanent. After determining what new settings work best in a particular print environment, the second part of this process is to apply these new settings to the Onyx Media Profile. Before altering the Media Profile, you may want to clone the existing one to preserve that profile. You can then edit the copy and then decide later which one you want to delete. Highlight your printer and then select Configure Printer. On the Media tab, choose the Media Type. Then, highlight the media that needs to be edited and choose Mode Options. Select the mode that is being edited and then press Options. In the Mode Options window, choose Advanced Options. Adjust the warm-up drying temp offset and, if applicable, the warm-up curing temp offset to match the settings that were determined during testing. Then choose OK, Save Settings, OK, and OK again. The new settings have been applied and will now be used when printing with that particular media profile and mode. If you have any questions about the HP L25500, L26500, or L28500, please contact a LexTech customer specialist at 800-453-9538.